What's going on? My name is Dan and in today's video we're going to compare the, the Clash Yosemite with a couple of other cars in GTA Online. With the Yosemite being one of the most so-called sleepers in GTA Online, this one is a real sleeper. And you will find out in this video why. So, without further ado, let's get straight into it. So the Yosemite is one of the firstly added vehicles with the Doomsday Heist. It's an incredibly good car and also it isn't too expensive. So if you're looking for a fast car that looks like shit, because you can definitely make a farm truck like mine. I can make a video of that if you guys want me to. Um, it will kind of look like this, which is from Street Outlaws that was also a sleeper. So. Let's go and drag race this hot knife right here. So I'm going to throw a grenade out of the window. As soon as it explodes, we're going to step on the gas. As you guys can see, I'm obliterating that hot knife just with the Yosemite. I would consider that hot knife faster, but in this case, I, it appears that the beater sleeper truck is incredibly fast. So let's check on which vehicle we should compare it with now. So we're going to compare the Yosemite against the Duke of Death, the Phantom Wedge and uh, the Classic Tampa. So the same goes again, the grenade. We'll blow up and then we're going to floor it. Oh shit. Bye bye. <laughs> So the Yosemite is at front now, and we're going to compare it against a couple of supercars. So we're now going to compare it to the Overflot Autark, the Fagner, and the X80 Proto. So let's select the grenade. XID Pro though is at first now. I can actually keep up with them, but uh, it appears that this is not the fastest acceleration, so it is decently fast for a muscle car, but it will not win from one of these supercars. So this was today's video on the Yosemite. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. For more videos like this, also subscribe and also if you want to comment on my video. Thank you for watching and see you all later. Peace out.